This was um, a moment at 80, 78 kilometers from the line when uh, Lotte Kopecki caught Sofia Bertizzolo and, yeah, thought, well, OK, we're going for it. But then uh, about 20 kilometers later, she was caught by Mount Rijnbeek back in the peloton. And um, we saw a flurry of attacks, so to say, with many groups off the road. This is Anja Lau, the rider from Tasmania of the Age Insurance Sudal team who went on a long breakaway. Gradually, she got joined by a little group of three, including uh, uh, Valerie de Meij. But this was the moment here on the uh, Lange Afstraat where Turbo Lotte bridged across to our leading four, L left them standing. That was that was it. They just left them standing. The pace there generated by Lotte Kopecki was absolutely insane. Bringing across uh, Lorena Vibus, Arlene Sierra, and also um, and Lily Williams, another counter group, another two riders from Movistar in this group with uh, Makai with Norskart and then here on the cobbles of the Lange Astraat, the others were the Herlegemstraat. The Lange Astraat, she made her move. She said in the post-race interview, this was what we agreed upon, that I would try on the Lange Astraat and um, see if I could make it across uh, make it to the front on my own, and that's exactly what happened. Of course, they always have a plan B in Lorena Vibus, but today it was plan A and plan A was not to go Sprint for second was hardly a sprint because Lorena Vibus um, took another second place, keeping her perfect score of a top five place in each and every edition. Intact, just like this woman. She was in the top four of this race in all five editions and won two of them. Last year, 2023, and this year, she does it again. In rainbow stripes, no less. The photo finish was absolutely useless today. We didn't need it. This is a close one, no? half a wheel in the end but a good result there for Lily Williams who was strong bridging across to uh, Kopecki and Vibus and also another great result there for the 21 uh, year old Sophie van Roy she won her first bike race UCI bike race I should say on Saturday in Dwingelo and she does uh, another top five today the mountain prize goes to of course Lotte Kopecki who finished on top of Nokerberg the first time and the third time around like we already have um, some of the vehicles in front of the men's race inside. But we're going to uh, give you the podium ceremony.